Hi, my name is Hannah Selinger. I'm one of the copywriters here at Aster Wines and Spirits and Aster Center. And I'm also a certified sommelier. You may notice that some rosés are darker than others, some white wines are darker than others. So I'm just going to discuss why that is often the case. The color in wine comes from skin, so grapes that have thicker skins, like something like Pinot Gris on the white end of the spectrum or Syrah on the red end of the spectrum are going to give off more color when pressed, um, and that accounts for the color differentiation in the final product in the wine. With rosé, you'll notice that some rosés will be very, very light in color, particularly rosés that you see from Provence, but also these days um, the rosés that you see from New York State also can be very, very light, what we call onion skin. And some rosés, notably the rosés that you see from Spain or sometimes Italy, will be really dark in color. That has to do with a method that we call saunier or skin contact. The more time that a wine that it's, that's being pressed is spent in contact with the skins of the red grapes, the more color pigment it picks up. A consequence of aging in wines is that uh, they tend to change in color. In white wines, uh, they tend to turn darker and more golden in hue. You particularly see this in varietals like Riesling and Chardonnay, which are wines that are more age-worthy, although um, wines like Riojas are actually designed to age and they're prone to oxidation and, and are sometimes intentionally oxidized, which means that oxygen is presented into the wine intentionally, um, that presence of oxygen actually um, changes the color of the wine. And in fact, um, because corks are porous, oxygen is what changes the color of the wine over time. So you'll see a wine that is somewhat clear when it's first bottled will become more yellow and honeyed over time. Um, you can actually sort of see it progress. Um, the same is true with red wines. The cork is porous and a wine will actually turn more toward brown. Um, a wine will be very bright red, and it will turn more sort of burgundy as it ages. The next time you have two glasses in front of you and you're wondering why they look so different in color, now you know why.